I was absolutely delighted to be asked to be here at the conference with the St Helens Teaching Schools Alliance. I can't wait to share this text with all these teachers because they've had such a buzzing day about how wonderful language can be. It's a heartfelt story about a little girl called Lizzie and she's got a lovely, lovely life uh, until one fateful evening when a storm brings a tornado into the town and suddenly her world's turned inside out by a ragtaggle group of birds and suddenly she's found the friend she's always been looking for. I wanted to actually use my book in school and as a consultant I was really aware of what children had to learn so I tried really hard to come up with lots of activities, things that they'd be really excited by because I wanted a handbook that teachers could pick up to give them lots and lots of ideas about how to bring English to life. So as you work through the book some pages are packed with action, other pages packed with character, so it's full of dialogue, it's full of speech bubbles, a perfect page for design. And we've actually got here a campaign to save the tree where the birds are living in Lizzie's house. And most importantly, I wanted there to be characters for everybody. I was really passionate, and so was Mick, who did all the illustrations, that there'd be something for absolutely everybody on that page, whether you were into Egglet, Crow, Rainbow Bird, or you're in a cheeky bird. I wanted something that would connect with all children. My friend Maddie was working with a group of teachers in the Federation in St Helens to inspire them to get into writing. So all the schools went away using this picture and created stories and descriptions and everything about Lizzie. And then one evening I was talking to Prime Ed and they actually asked me what had happened to the book that we created. That was when the perfect marriage of a great publishing company and hopefully a great book sort of came together and that's where you know, Lizzie and the Birds has come from.